What about uh, your experience with the young director Piero Messina? Che peccato questa uomo. No, it was great. I, I mean, we we had to uh, at the beginning, you know, he's very willingful and all, of course because he was it was really, you know, it was his first film, so the it, the, the the risk of it is very big. So I understood that he was very nervous about, you know, every detail and wanted to have everything the, as, as best as he could. And so at the beginning it was, I felt it was a little too much on me. And so uh, after two, two days, on the, th on the third day I say, uh, Piero, we have to speak because you have to leave me space, you know, you have to let me breathe. Otherwise you're going to miss things, you know, you, you cannot do everything with control. So we had a... Um, a deal together. I said, okay, yeah, I, give me three takes hmm. without you saying anything. <laughs> and then the rest of it, we can do a hundred takes if you want. <laughs> I'm there for you. And that's what, that was our deal. And uh, it worked well because there was, uh, during the whole time, I felt very, uh, uh, the complicity between us was, was genuine and, and, and the need of, of, of going into the depth of the story and the dangers of it as well. You know, I was, I was very keen that we didn't feel my character being manipulative mm. because that was the danger of it, that she's not using Jeanne Lou's character uh, in, a, you know, in, a, in a sort of a perverse way, you know, but it was just that genuinely she could not say the truth and that I was very uh, vigilant Mm -hmm. about that 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 need and and i mean the whole time it was a joy really a joy to uh see him birth and uh and i i love seeing a director that has uh, um who's demanding mm -hmm. who's precise who's uh, you know he he's really looking at the, the the place of the camera he's really looking at all the takes so for me, it's very, uh, because I'm a little like that, even though I have to abandon myself in the take, but I like to be uh, quite, you know, try and elevate yourself as much as you can, because it's an art form. And also you're gonna, you know, invite people to spend time in seeing it. So mm -hmm. I think this time is very precious. Mm -hmm. And so you give the best you can in a film, that's it. You shoot too in Sicily, wonderful. Uh... Yes. Yes, because I remember Piero was saying, I, I don't want to film Sicily like we used to see it in, uh, in films. Uh, it's really not the, the touristic, you know, Sicily I want to show. It's uh, uh, different kind of landscapes. And so I was like, you know, discovering it and going to the museum in the middle of the night. I was fascinated. I've never, you know, I didn't know you could, you could visit a, a museum in Italy uh, uh, so late. Because he told me that in in the in the night time it's cooler. In the daytime you don't want to you don't want to visit. You want to lie down and 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 <laughs> and wait for it to pass. <laughs> the 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 the. It's very cold.